Thunder. Choose your track. Hello everybody, and welcome to as the game said, Hydro Thunder. This is a game that um, I kind of got into a little bit thanks to Big Trevi. Um, I've actually kind of played a game like this, because uh, it seems familiar, but I remembered that I played a game called H2 Overdrive in an arcade in Barmouth in Wales specifically, like ages ago, and this is quite similar to that in a way, but this is actually really cool. Um, I have played a little bit because I've unlocked medium and hard tracks. I haven't actually, like, unlocked the bonus ones, which I'd like to do. I apparently have to win first in every track, I think, to have unlocked every bonus track. And I think there's also bonus boats. So, I am going to be doing a, bit of a little bit of a series on this because I want to do something a bit more nostalgic. And I think this would be cool. Now, I'm not the best at this game, but I'm going to learn. Um, I think Tidal Blade was what Big Trevor said was probably the best boat. But I think I might stick with easy on the easy tracks. I may have to use the easy boats on the hard tracks. But it's kind of like a challenge of using these boats on the hard one. Maybe. We'll see. I have to win first on those ones. But we'll take it easy. I go for misbehave. It said there to finish first in hard to do that. There's apparently a way you can get a boost start, but I actually don't know how to do that. I think probably works on the same logic of like Mario Kart. Um so I'm not the best at this game, I'm alright, but I'm still trying to learn some techniques. There's apparently a way you can sort of break and then boost to fling yourself in the air like... Like that, okay. That's quite simple, but I guess that actually helps. Um, to do things. So it's like, boom, okay. That's quite neat. That's actually quite easy to do, and I missed the red. But that's fine. I mean, I'm doing all right. <laughs> I didn't know there was a red one up there. How are you supposed to get up there? Um. So yeah, my aim is to get first place on all the tracks because that would be cool to get. But we shall see what happens. But then, this is a really cool game. I'm kind of glad I started to play it. <laughs> I, I like little arcade games like this. They're just really fun to play, like simple experiences. And uh, they're always like so fun to play in the arcades. I remember H2 Overdrive had like a pin system where you could, uh, you could save your game effectively. Oh, can I make it in time? Ah. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> I came second. We're gonna try that again. But we're going to use Tidal Blade. Ah, uh, we've definitely got this. And... Boost, come on, come on. Go over him. There we go. Alright, title played. You're a good boat. And I even beat my high school. That was pretty cool. <laughs> and yeah, I usually just go for Lum. That's a bit of a nickname. Oh, I didn't beat my high school. I was close, though. Well, that's one down. Let's go to Thunder Park. Um... Which one was the one that was easier for turning? Because they do have different... You're crazy. I love that, just, you're crazy! <laughs> they do have, like, different stats. I think Tidal Blade's the fastest, maybe, in the medium category. But maybe doesn't have the best turning. We'll try Fresher. We'll give him a try. So this one's like a two lap race. I think this is the only one that has laps. From what I remember. 
Let's get around there and get this. Okay. I need to practice a little bit on how to do the jump boost thing. So I know that there's some boosts on this track that you can get. Like this one over there on the bridge. You gotta go like like that to get it and kind of clip that. <laughs> but that was quite neat. That was pretty good. What do you mean fourth place? Get out of there. I was in third. I don't think I'm going to get it in time. Oh wait, no, is this the final lap, or...? Okay, we're on the final lap now. So, we can still catch up. But I've used those boosts to try and get this one here. Or not. <laughs> okay, we can catch up. We got him. finish right there. <laughs> Straight up like photo finish. <laughs> Alright, Arctic Circle. Last of the easy one. Um, you know, we'll stick with medium guys. Because it seems like, I guess if you have... I think if you're using medium boats, you have medium AI and easy, but not hard, I think. Um... We'll go for Tidal Blade again. I can trust this guy, I guess. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. I know that there's also secrets, like, on track. I know of, like, one. Oh, I think there's a secret area there. Now I'm curious now, I'm actually curious. I'm going to restart. It seems like there's something there, but I was trying to practice it a little, but couldn't quite get in there. So what else? Once you fail, you couldn't really turn around and try again, it just kind of pushed me back. So let's just try and win the race normally. I'm not going to risk it this time. Surely there's like also other ways of earning boost. I guess from doing tricks, not tricks. I've definitely noticed moments where I have gained boost without picking up these things, but I guess they might be like super secret hidden places. Question mark. I don't know. <laughs> Up there was one of the boats, we just destroyed it. <laughs> Keep that boost going. We're in sixth place, not bad. Still got a fair bit of the track left. I think. Yep. There's a person in first place. Come on, I can get you. Let's get the boost. No, come on. Man. Yes! Woo. Another bit of a close call that I won. <laughs> Alright, that's all the easy mode tracks down. 
And I guess we can move on to medium. Where we have Grease Isles, Lake Paddle, and the Far East. But I think I'll do that in the next one. Just want to do a little quick recording. This might be shorter than my usual kind of videos because it doesn't take long to get through the tracks. Uh, hard mode might be a little bit longer because I may record for a little while trying to beat them and showing off the different the different boats. I think New York Disaster is probably one of my favourite ones though, just aesthetically. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this little gameplay of Hydro Thunder and I'll see you for the medium tracks.